Hello guys, today we're doing a fight that I'm a little bit late on doing, you know I like to update, update these like MOG trials the first day, but you know I was busy with uh, Malbro and all that when this came out. But anyway, uh, we're going to be doing March of the Lord on the Underworld. It's the uh, S-Star fight for the week 2 Final Fantasy, no I'm sorry, Dragon Quest collaboration. <laughs> Um, but anyway, we're going to be doing a budget style, you know, no trust masteries, no rainbows, and we're going to be grabbing a friend. So the way we're doing this fight is we're going to be using Snow for the passive taunt setup. Um, he's got, you know, some defense, spirit, etc. He's geared in passive taunt, so all he has to do is defend every turn. And he's got safety bit for death immunity. Uh, Rosa is going to be doing um, heals, uh, mana regen, etc., the usual kind of stuff. Uh, Melee Duel has got Genji Shield for the other death immunity, and she's got um, some defense, some resistance, and we've given her dual cast rays in the spell, so she can have a little bit more, um, uh, what's it called, some more like flexibility on her support options. Uh, Mystia is going to be our magical cover, and she's geared for um, immunity to fire, ice, and darkness, as well as even with the darkness and peril, she'd still be immune, which is useful. Garnet is going to be our um, summoner for the Esper, also a backup resurrection and healer and Cradle of Horns, that kind of goodness. And uh, we're grabbing, now y'all have told me I'm pronouncing this wrong, uh, Hiyo, he he Hiyo, Hiyo, whatever. It's, <laughs> it's, it's the new big unit on Global. Uh, and this one is set up, he's obviously set up for the, the Malboro trial, but we're going to grab him anyway, because even though his gear is not set up for this fight perfectly, uh, it shouldn't really matter. Uh, yeah. So let's get into it. Uh, the missions are no items, uh, finish with a limit burst, and, uh, what's that last mission? Oh, summon Shiva. So to start off, boss is going to buff himself with um, a mitigation buff. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use Hiyo or Hiyo, Hiyo to, dis <laughs> to dispel this. Uh, his unknown traitor is an AoE dispel, which is kind of convenient. So we can't remove the mitigations though. Uh, so Snow is just going to guard, that's all he's going to do. Misty is going to magical cover. Garnet's going to give us Cradle of Horns. Rosa is going to give us Bless, and Melia Duel is going to break the attack and magic of the boss. Now, my Melia Duel is not enhanced. Um, if you enhance her, her breaks are much better, but as y'all know, I'm, I'm pretty cheap when it comes to enhancements. I try to not enhance units until they absolutely have to. Alright, so let's go ahead and start doing some... Um, Actually, it was in peril. Flame blade and serve another blade. Let's do some damage with Hayo. See how see what kind of damage we deal. All right, not bad. The mitigation stuff is why the damage is so low right now. Uh, so we're gonna guard. We're going to prepare the Gaia launch for Esper. Melia duel will give us stop immunity. Oh, Snow's already stopped. Ah, that's okay. Because Snow passively taunts. We don't really care that he stopped. Alright, so next turn the boss is going to AoE dispel us, which is really, really annoying. We're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to fill the... No, we're going to, we're going to guard everyone. Actually, we're going to re-break with Melee Duel. The uh, Melee Duel is actually tanky enough to survive, even during the, the dispel. So here's the AoE dispel, and now he still does his attacks, even after the dispel. And that, that's why we like um, Snow as a passive conquer. Because even after the Dispel, he's still taking all those hits. And he counters for a lot of Limit Crystals, which is kind of useful. Alright, so we'll put up Cradle of Horns. We got Dispel. We'll guard Snow. We'll put up 
magical cover. We will put up stop immunity. We'll put up bless. And how you is gonna go ahead and flame blade and serve as blade. Like we're not trying to do a ton of damage right now, we're just trying to get these limit gauges filled and stuff. Alright, so there's the big AoE that, that the boss does every now and then. And there's the AoE death that happened every now and then too, so Garnet took it that time. It's an AoE death, but it's only a 15% chance per target. And of course, Snow and Melee Door are completely immune. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and dual cast Rosa. Uh, full life on Garnet, and we'll do a little bit of healing. Guard Snow. Break the boss's attack and magic again. Uh, when's the next spell? Turn 7. Uh, Mystia will just refresh Tritalia Wall. And Hayo will... Oh, Triple Blade. Nice. Uh, let's just serve another blade three times. When's the next threshold? The next threshold is at 80%. He's going to do an AoE magic attack, but we're recovering it, so we don't really care. Oh, we didn't push it anyway. Yeah, the boss's mitigation lasts five turns. It's kind of kind of obnoxious, <laughs> just to be honest. And we're not breaking the boss's defense yet either, or spirit. Alright, so now we've got enough Esper Gauge to summon Shiva. I'm gonna go ahead and knock that out before I um forget. Alright, let's go ahead and oh, one, one. summon Shiva. Uh, turn six, there's nothing really going on. So we'll just guard Mystia. We'll bless. Of course, Snow is going to guard as usual. And I'm going to go ahead and break the boss's uh, defense. Or is there, there it is, crush armor. So now, we, now that we finish the missions, we can do a little bit of extra damage. Alright, so we pushed the 70% threshold. The boss is going to buff himself and lordly stance, and here's the 70% threshold. Now, it was important that we push this threshold in a turn that he does not dispel, because all this bad stuff happened, and he's got his buffs up right now. Yeah, so he's going to dispel next turn. So we're going to go ahead and get him debuffed. Where's Garnet dispel? Let's dispel the boss. Let's break the attack and magic again. Snow will guard. Uh, Mystia will put up... Actually, no. Mystia's gonna guard. We're gonna, we're gonna guard everyone. Because we don't want to die when they put this to dispel. There's the dispel. Here comes the, um... The stuff. Alright, so Snow's gonna guard. We'll put up Stop immunity. Melia duel. Mystia will magical cover. Garnet will create a horn. Wooden bless with um, Rosa. And we will triple. Let's go ahead and Phantom Blade for the good in peril and Servant of the Blade twice. The boss has mitigation again, so it's um. This is not going to be too much damage. Alright, so the next big threshold is at 40%. Alright, let me break the boss's defense and spirit. Did you activate triple cast? He did not, but that's okay. Let's do that, let's do that. Uh, so 40% is the next big threshold, yeah. Uh, turn 11 is the next big AoE. Or the next spell. Uh, Garnet will just refresh Cradle of the Wands. Rose's, um, Regen will take care of Mystia. 
All right, so here's the AOE death. Uh, no one died. Oh, Rosa died. Boo. Sorry. All right, unfortunately, I think I have to just break the boss again this turn. Uh, so we'll raise with Garnet. Uh, Misty will try Teliwall, we'll guard with Snow. And Hiyu will serve it up the play. Hopefully we can place that 40% threshold. We did. Outstanding. So here comes his buff. Here's a Lightning Storm threshold. Okay, he's not dispelling until next turn. So next turn he's going to dispel us, so let's be ready for that. Uh, so we're going to guard Garnet, we're going to guard Snow. Uh, we're going to. Oh no, we need to dispel the boss. Actually, we're going to do it with Hayo because he's very tanky, so he, he doesn't need to guard. Because uh, it's an unknown traitor for that dispel. Uh, Melia duel will break attack and magic. Uh, can Misty a heal? Is she on a unit with healing? No, she cannot. What effort is she on? Diablos. Alright, so Misty will guard, and Rose is going to go ahead and heal, heal herself. Actually, she'll do it with Bless. It'll give, it'll give, it'll heal her, and it'll give, um, Kayo some mana. Alright, so Rosa does have on, um, I mean, she has high spirits. So I don't think she would die for this. Okay, she didn't. Outstanding. So now we're just waiting for the boss's mitigation to wear off, and then we'll finish him off with he you. He you. He you. <laughs> uh, turn 15 is the next to spell. Alright, so our buffs are gone, so we're going to refresh that. We're going to guard Snow. We're going to stop immunity. Uh, we're going to... We're not going to bless this turn. We're going to go ahead and do some real healing. We're going to create the horns. Uh, we're going to go ahead and double blade. Phantom blade still on cooldown. So we'll flame blade and servant blade. So the boss is not going to be doing any more of his mitigation buffs at this point. So once they wear off, we'll go ahead and finish them off with you. Break the defense and spirit of the boss. And we will break the attack and magic of the boss. We'll put up Bless. And let's go ahead and. No, I don't want a Phantom Blade quite yet. I'll save that cooldown. We'll just Flame Blade and Servant of the Blade. Okay. So the next threshold is at 20%. The boss is going to do a um, AoE dark. we got to make sure we don't push a 20% on turn 15. That's the next AoE spell. Alright, let's go ahead and just double servant. Hopefully we can push the 20% this turn. Oh yeah, we did. Outstanding. Uh, so let's create the horns. We're gonna go ahead and guard Mystia, guard Snow. We'll break the bosses, attack and magic again, and we will refresh Bless. So this is gonna be another uh, dark AOE, but Mystia is gonna cover that for us. It's called Lightning Storm, but it's actually dark damage. I know it's kind of strange. All right. Oh, the stupid. Ugh. That death attack. So annoying. Alright, no big deal. No big deal. Uh, 
Uh, so Garnet will raise Rosa. We'll guard, we'll guard. We'll go ahead and summon Lakshmi with um, her. Alright, we're going to Phantom Blade. Which is going to put up a good uh, imperil on the boss. I'm pretty sure next turn the boss is going to wear off with his um, mitigation. And we can go ahead and finish him with the Limit Burst. Alright, so that was the Dispel. And yeah, it looks like the um, mitigation has worn off. Alright, no mitigation. His defense buff is up. So, have at it, Hayo. He you. Boom. Finish with a burst complete. There it is. And I'm sure y'all have realized it's not hard to find a he you friend right now. He yo friend. You know, the. <laughs> My friend list is about 90% he used right now. <laughs> we just grab one of them and do the fight. Pretty sure we got all the missions. There it is. Alright. I will see y'all soon.